Hello everyone and welcome to a special edition of our Player Profile Series. I'm Dan Salzer with Plymouth State Broadcasting and we're joined today by junior skier for the Plymouth State women's ski team and Freitas Einer's daughter. Freitas, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. First of all, from all of us here at Plymouth State, we'd like to congratulate you on making the Winter Olympics in South Korea in a couple of weeks time for your home country of Iceland. Thank you. Your freshman year, you were interviewed by the Plymouth Magazine, and they asked you what your motivation was every day. Your response was that you wanted to make the 2017 World Championships and also the 2018 Winter Olympics. Now that you've achieved both of those goals, how does it feel to have reached you know, both of those dreams? It feels great. Obviously, I feel accomplished. I'm happy that I managed to achieve those goals. Um, I've been aiming for this a long time, and I'm just happy that I finally know that I get to go to both these huge races and I'm really happy and proud. You just missed out on making the 2014 Winter Olympics in Russia uh, but the last two and a half years as a collegiate racer here in the United States how has being a collegiate racer really helped you prepare to accomplish your goal this year in 2018? It has helped me a lot. I, I'm not even sure I would have reached these goals if I wouldn't have been here. Like. Staying here, being on the PSU ski team, being able to train, race with a, at this circuit that the college circuit is, racing against all those good girls every weekend all winter long just really motivates me. Um, it has helped me push myself harder, train harder and work harder in training and um, it's just really helped me get to where I am today. A lot of speculation the last couple of months of if you would make the team or not. But talk us through when you officially got word that you made the Icelandic team for the Winter Olympics. And how did that make you feel? What was your reaction to getting the official word? I was, when I found out for sure that it was confirmed that I was going, I was super happy and a little bit relieved because I've known for a few months that I was possibly going. But it was never confirmed. It was never 100%. So this weekend when I got... I saw my flight tickets and I got like a confirmation that I was actually going that just a huge relief and um, I'm really happy and it just felt great knowing that. We know you're traveling separate from your team just because of the mm -hmm. distance over to South Korea instead of heading back to Iceland and then over. But who else are you bringing with you family wise or close friends wise to South Korea to root you on and how influential have they been over the course of your career to get you to this point? Um, both my parents are going to be there in South Korea. I'll just meet them there when I get there. Um, obviously, both of them have helped me immensely. I can't even explain how much they have supported me and helped me to get to this point. They have like followed my ski career ever since I was seven years old. They taught me how to ski, and um, having them there obviously means a lot to me. My dad will definitely be on the hill. My mom's always just on the stands watching. She's not going to be on the hill, but having them there just means a lot. And um, one other, one of my best friends is racing for Iceland as well. He's going to be the male alpine skier. And uh, I grew up skiing with him, and I've, we've skied together for over 10 years on the same local team at home. So it's also going to be a, a huge support having him there and um, having friends and family. Really, it means a lot. We know there's a lot of strict rules with the, the uh, Skiing Federation and also the Winter Olympic Committee of branding with uniforms. Uh, mm -hmm. But kind of what Plymouth State University specific item you might bring with you as a good luck charm and kind of what does that item, what is that item I should say, and what does it mean to you? So I'm probably going to bring my necklace that I got last year. So from PSU I got a really cool necklace for making the NCAA championships. Um, it's like a silver necklace with a green diamond which is supposed to represent the Green Panthers and um, definitely going to bring that with me. Um, I have some Plymouth clothes, socks, shirts that I'll probably bring with me, hopefully be able to wear at some point but definitely bringing Plymouth with me to South Korea and I'll be fun. Well, Freitas, we congratulate you once again. And fans, be sure to follow along with Freitas online at NBCOlympics.com. Find out when she will be racing and follow along with all of her times in her races in the next coming, uh, coming weeks over in South Korea. Freitas, all of us here at Plymouth State are rooting you on. Everyone back in Iceland, thank you for joining us. Best of luck at the Winter Olympics. Thank you.